Bros, I wrote my sins down and just thought of all my goals I was jumping over fences, forces kicking down these doors On the road, we not related, no, we not related Everything I ever said before was calculated Girl, we messing up, now we all isolated Rolling up these blunts and popping pills, I'm agitated On the real, I don't need you Fake, see, fake, on the real, I don't see you Most of all these niggas always acting, but they see through I always kept it straight, baby, girl, I never leave you Hey, baby, girl, I never leave you Just pull it up to the light. Just stop lot. But when they build these houses, I gotta find a new lot. We got the lot, we're gonna practice some wheelies. As you can see, we got the lot. Like the first 10 minutes getting warmed up. I already got arm pump. I gotta get my my, my arm strong. I gotta get my agility right. Up. You know, it take a little second when you first hop on the bike to like, you know, get used to it, get the feel back. You know what I'm saying? Even if you was riding yesterday, it just take a little quick second to get right. So that's basically just how I warm up real quick. Just and then the arm pump come, then I gotta take a break. You don't wanna keep riding when your arms hurt because you're gonna regret it in the end. So as soon as you feel your arms start to hurt, get off the bike and just, just rest for a second because I done did, the time, did that plenty times and it's not good. It's going to damage your arm for real. You're going to be hurting for a couple days. So just get off right quick. Let it calm down. You can get back on. So I'm going to put the helmet back on it and get back on for like a second round. After round two, I feel like I'm doing complete trash right now. Like, I just feel trash. Like, that shit not good enough. I can do better, for real. But 
that's really part of all like that's part of getting nice on the bikes like you're gonna have days that like you feel like you don't progress at all for real and make you question like damn do i even want to keep do i even want to keep doing this you feel me but that's when like you just got to keep grinding through it like the next time you come back you fuck around have a whole breakthrough you're doing crazy shit like you way way colder than you thought so you just got to stick through them like days where you feel like you ain't making progress because if i really look back to where i started i done made hella progress so when you come up days you don't feel like you make progress just keep going that's gonna that's them the days that really make you cold right there for real Back at the lot, day two. See if we can make some more progress from last time. Second day, second day back at the lot, already a big, like, big difference. Like, I'm already feeling way comfortable from last time. Like, just everything better. I'm doing better. Like, you can just see it in the videos. That's just, that's what happens when you constantly keep coming. Like, you can't take long breaks. You gotta, if you want to get good at wheeling, you gotta keep coming, like, every day or at least every other day, you know? So, that's why I'm getting, I'm finally seeing progress now because I'm not coming just once a week or once every two weeks, you're not gonna find no progress like that. You really gotta be consistent. So like, I'm finally, like, I'm, it's finally paying off me being consistent after all those hard times of me wanting to give up, not being able to wheelie. You just gotta keep getting back on the bike. And now it's just like the second day of me consistently practicing and I'm already like feeling way better, already, <clears throat> already getting way better. So I'm about to go out for uh, round two. We gonna see.
block, that was the second day going consistently. It's a big difference. I made a hell of progress. You can just tell by the videos. I finally popped it up. Uh, I, I had trouble popping the clutch. I didn't know how to do it. Like, I, I just couldn't pop it up with the clutch. I just be in first gear popping it up without the clutch, just off the throttle. But, you know, if you want to wheelie in second or third, you got to use the clutch. So I finally practiced today using the clutch. Finally popped it up in second. Shit, way smoother. Second gear is way smoother to wheelie in. But I kind of just want to learn it first just because it's first. So I didn't want to just kind of like, I just wanted to focus on first. Now I'm a little smoother with first. I felt like, let me try the second. And it's true. They say second gear is more smoother. It definitely is. You know, I'm familiar with first before you do second, but you can do whatever you want. That's just what I, what I think and how I did it. But it felt good to finally get it up in second. That's going to wrap it up. We're going we gonna to be back tomorrow and we're going to see what, what progress we can make. All right, man, we back at the lot. It's like day three. We're gonna make some more progress. I've been uh, wheeling in, in second gear lately. It's way more smoother and we're going way more longer. So I'm, I'm gonna continue to play with uh, second gear and see what I can do with that. Let's do it. Texas 100 degrees at 10 at night. I'm just uh, making progress, man. Uh, I've been wheeling in second gear. I'm be going way. I go way longer in second gear. I'm, I still want to like you know. I want to master first gear. Gear though, you feel me? I want to be good in first gear, but I, I've been messing in second gear too. It's just so much smoother. It's like it's just so much smoother. It's hard to explain. It's just a feeling. It's a little easier type shit. But now that I'm wheeling longer, my hand hurts so bad, bro. All you guys who already ride, like, let me know, like, how do y'all get past that? Like, dude, arm hurts so bad, I'll be having to stop after just like 10 minutes. I'm trying to, I'm trying to knee knock for the first time. I'm still, it's just so, it's so sketchy when I, when I try to bring it up on, and I'm, and I'm in a knee knock. But like when I'm wheeling, I'll be scared to go into a knee knock. So I don't know how, which way it's gonna come first. We We're gonna have to see, cause I'm, I'm like upgrading, so I'm ready to, you know, start doing. Start doing some more, start doing some new stuff. Probably just gonna go like one more time. It's hella hot out here, man. I'm ready for fall, but I'm gonna try to do some of the, I'm gonna try to hit a knee knock for the last video. Yo, that's what I'm gonna try to do. Bet.